Tokyo, narrow streets, lots of people, very busy, not really the kind of place to drag your suitcase around. So in this video, I'm gonna tell you some luggage storage options that are easy to find in central Tokyo. When it comes to storing your luggage so that you can explore Tokyo hands-free, there's a few different options, including lockers, your hotel, and train station service desks. Lockers, great option for storing your luggage in central Tokyo. You'll find them in most major train stations. You can store luggage for up to three days in a locker, and they typically cost anything from about 300 yen to eight, 900 yen per day. You can pay using cash or an IC card, like a Suica or a Pasmo, and most of them have a handy English interface, so they're pretty easy to use. Most lockers these days don't have a key, so to retrieve your luggage, either tap your IC card again, or if you paid with cash, use the code that was printed on the receipt. A pro tip is lockers close to the station gates can fill up quickly, but if you don't mind going for a short walk, you can usually find lockers with the green open light further away. Some train stations such as Tokyo Station even have interactive maps showing the status of lockers around you. If you'd rather not try your luck with finding a locker, then another option for storing your luggage is service desks. These are locations where you can drop your luggage off and know that it will be stored safely no matter the size. In the west of Tokyo, at Shibuya Station, is the Tourist Information Center Wonder Compass, which provides luggage storage. To access it, head across Shibuya Scramble Crossing, down the stairs onto the basement floor, and then turn left. Wonder Compass is really handy. It's just below Shibuya Station. You can store a piece of luggage for 900 yen per day, and you can actually store luggage for multiple days. They open from 10 a.m. till 8 p.m., and you can pay by cash or credit card. At Tokyo Station, one of the biggest transport hubs and where you'll likely catch the Shinkansen from, there's also a few luggage service desks. So if you're in Tokyo Station, there's a number of travel service centers that will store your luggage like uh, Sagawa here. They can take your luggage for 800 yen a day and there's the JR East Travel Service Center, but they will only take your luggage for a maximum of one day. For information on service desks at other locations in Tokyo, do check out our luggage storage article. One other handy way to find locations is through apps. So there's a handy app called Ekbo Cloak that allows you to search for places to leave your luggage in Tokyo. You can see the opening hours, whether they speak English. Um, you can also reserve a spot through the app, but bear in mind it might actually cost more than if you turn up in person. So another luggage storage option is your hotel. Pretty much every hotel in Tokyo will accept your luggage for storage. So if you want to drop it off early on the day of check-in or leave it with them for a bit after you've checked out, most hotels will do that for you for free. Finally, if you're transiting through Narita or Haneda and looking to store your luggage at the airport, your two options are lockers and staffed luggage counters. Prices range from 300 to 1,000 yen per day depending on the size of your luggage and some counters will allow storage for up to 30 days. For more detailed information on both airports, check out our article linked in the description. Hope you enjoyed the video. Do subscribe for more.